Yo, what's up guys, Sensei here, and in today's video, we're gonna go through Nvidia Profile Inspector for Fortnite, um, and more specifically, Pate 2 graphics. Um, so yeah, first we're gonna wait for the battle to load in, now we'll go on Fortnite. Um, as always, super sampling on Airplay mode now. then over here, you want everything on off, except texture filtering, which is on on. Uh, quality on high quality, negative POD bias on allow, and then these two numbers on 0, 3, 7, 50. <clears throat> so a lot of people will go over that amount, which is fully pointless, um, unless you're going for like full potato graphics, which I think in my opinion is fully useless, um, for normal games at least. If you play only creative, then sure I guess, but um, if you want to play arena, or normal games and be able to see the enemy when he's crouched somewhere or when he's on a mountain then this value is the best um, as for the um, OGL it can go up to maybe 5000 uh, I've tried before 4375 which works fine uh, these settings changing it up to like 5000 won't affect anything you will still be able to see through mountains and stuff like that normally so that's fine if you go up but I personally recommend this to values and that's about the video pretty much like these are the best settings in my opinion um, if you want still the FPS boost and the delay boost of potato graphics what's we'll out but going over this amount on this two is just pointless if you're actually gonna play the game normally if you're playing as I said creative then you can go over that um, um, the maximum you can try maybe it's I'll say 1000 that will be like the max if you wanna go like fully potato graphics you will have the bugs with the mountains but again 1000 it's way better than any other value if you're going for like the full potato graphics if you want competitive style then it's for the best settings so yeah have fun